person that you've always been, but never dreamed. Tetris Effect was one of my favorite games of 2018. The combination of classic Tetris with stunning visuals and a marvelous soundtrack shot it up my list for Game of the Year, and it would have won it if it weren't for God of War. Nevertheless, Enhanced is releasing a new version of it for Xbox and PC this week, adding refinements to the single player and an all new multiplayer mode. The definition of the Tetris Effect is the phenomenon of doing something so much that it begins to create images in your mind, sometimes even invading your deepest dreams. It became a well-known common occurrence when those that played long hours of Tetris began to see blocks when they weren't playing the game at all. It coined the term Tetris Effect and it became the sensational inspiration for Mizuguchi's take on the series. Tetsuya Mizuguchi's talent has always been creating music-based games that create these magical sensations and reactions in people. They come together to create this extraordinary unique take on Tetris. Each level features its own theme and music that evoke different emotions when playing and that's the encompassing theme for this video game. Across the 30 levels, you'll visit the depths of space, the peaks of snowy tundras, and the vast dry fields of the desert. This is only scratching the surface. These levels are designed to have the visual backdrops and music synchronized with the gameplay. Drop a tetramino and hear a chime, clear a line and you'll hear a bell. Reach a certain score and have the entire level evolve along with the speed of the level. This assortment of synchronization, along with the game's presentation, would get me to feel this genuine emotional reaction to the gameplay. I felt happy singing and playing along to Connected in the deep level, while feeling this sort of melancholy sadness in this Aurora Peak level. The level of immersion felt unreal to me, the combination of playing in a dark room with a grey pair of headphones on a 4K display, it was easy to get lost in the game. Underneath all the bells and whistles, this is still classic Tetris, a timeless classic that feels even better here. For those still unfamiliar, Tetris is a puzzle game that has you drop different shaped tetraminos into a well as you clear lines and continue on with your score. Over time, as your score increases, the speed of the tetraminos begin to increase and as a result, the game gets progressively more challenging as well. By default, you have features like hold in your tetramino queue turned on, letting you both hold onto a piece for later while also seeing what the next tetramino will be. Both of these can be turned off though for anyone just wanting a more vanilla experience. With this iteration of the series also comes a new zone feature. As you begin to clear lines, you'll notice a zone meter at the bottom left start to fill up. With the press of your triggers, you can activate it sending you into this trance-like area where clear lines go to the bottom of the well. Time slows down and for the first time, you can clear lines above a Tetris, reaching things like a Dodecatris. It's mesmerizing and a new strategic factor in the gameplay. Overall, you're able to complete the journey mode in about an hour or two depending on your skill level and the difficulty you're playing on. Despite the short campaign though, I didn't feel like there was a lack of content here. As soon as I completed the game on normal, I immediately went back and played on expert. None of the levels or songs were even more important, the emotions felt overplayed at all. Newly added with this connected version of the game is a refined multiplayer mode with brand new game modes. Before, as you played either offline or online, you'd earn XP towards your ranking at the top of the screen. This was all represented in the effects mode or the online community for Tetris Effect. It was all very focused on community and leaderboards. However, a new connected mode acts as a co-op feature where three players can team up to play against an AI-controlled boss. It's an interesting take on the gameplay that, as far as I can remember, hasn't been done before. At times connecting three different walls into one, players work together in unity to take on a single higher level enemy as if it were a traditional head-to-head -head match. It oddly felt therapeutic in a way being able to play with my friends but not against each other for once. It was fun. For anyone else like myself that gets a bit too into Tetris, but wants someone else at a lower level to play with them, this is a great solution. On top of the connected mode is a new zone battle. This is a more traditional competitive mode where two players battle it out. When one opponent clears a line, trash Tetraminas will begin to pile up for the enemy. The variation with Tetris Effect is the inclusion of the zone mechanic that freezes time and lets you clear more lines at once. I was ecstatic to finally see this added to Tetris Effect as prior, I'd have to buy and launch Puyo Puyo Tetris to get any form of a modern versus mode. This version feels competent in performance and feel, and the presentation is just a bonus at this point. Lastly, there's Score Attack, which is similar to Zone Battle, though rather than competing for a well space, you're competing for the highest score. In this instance, you'd care more about how you clear your lines as opposed to how many lines you clear. Overall, this felt tailored toward more competitive Tetris play, something I really appreciated as someone that felt like it was imbalanced in Puyo Puyo Tetris. There's even a classic Score Attack variation that lets you play a modern take on NES Tetris. That means no hard drop, no holding cue, blocks lock whenever they touch another block, and the Tetramino algorithm completely changes. For anyone seeking a truly modern take on classic Tetris, this is the best it's ever been. Tetris Effect is a visual joyride that raises the bar on Mizuguchi's game design. 
Yes, it's still Tetris, but the feeling of the Tetris effect is so perfectly recreated by the visual experience constantly happening around the well. Throughout the journey mode, you'll be taken to coachside beaches, depths of space, and all sorts of exotic locations. The variety of locations and themes was fantastic, and only further increased the emotions the music had me feeling. In terms of performance, the Xbox Series X ran the game at 4K60, while the Series S managed to maintain 1440p 60fps locked. The Xbox One X and One S, on the other hand, dipped down to 1080p while the X targets 60 frames per second and the S targets 30 frames per second. Sadly, neither one can keep it locked with some occasional dips in the multiplayer mode. During gameplay, you can use the analog stick to zoom in and out of the board or even change up the angle to your liking. If the effects are a bit too much for you, you can turn them down a bit, but it won't completely shut it off. While I personally didn't have any issues with the effects, those who are a bit more sensitive should probably see direct gameplay before deciding to pick up this game. What is there even to say here? I loved it. Mizuguchi's games are really known for their attention to detail with music, and Tetris Effect is at the peak of it all. Since the moment I saw the announcement trailer back at E3 2018, I've had I'm Yours Forever stuck in my head, and it's with that said that it surprised me just how much the other tracks in this game were able to live up to it. I don't want to spoil the songs in this review because listening to them blindly is a joy that shouldn't be taken away from you, but let's just say that you owe it to yourself to buy this game's soundtrack. The way your actions perfectly become in sync with the elements of the songs is marvelous. It's something short of magical and enchanting. Tetris Effect Connected continues to be my favorite version of Tetris. It takes the timeless gameplay that we grew up playing and reimagines it in unforgettable ways. When a simple puzzle game like Tetris can make you feel genuine happiness and sadness, you know it's a special game. The new performance optimizations added to the single player, along with the added multiplayer modes for both versus and co-op, made this the definitive way to play Tetris.